What's up guys, I do myself here and welcome back to the channel. Happy New Year's, happy 2017. There's so much information I wanted to pack into one video. A lot of things happened in the last week and I kind of wanted to go ahead and tell you guys everything I know and anything I know about in terms of jailbreaking, in terms of software release, new iOS versions and new features coming that you guys will be very, very excited for. So without further ado, let's just dive right into everything I want to share with you guys. So first I want to talk about iOS 10.2.1. If you're following me here on the channel, you know that it is in its third beta stage and that could be released to the public today. I may be filming that video as you're watching this one or maybe tomorrow on the third it could be released. Again, we're talking about iOS 10.2.1. One. Not many features coming with that software, but a lot of security improvements. So now let's shift our attention over to iOS 10.3. All right, so 10.3 is a new software that's set to be released on January the 10th. Okay, now this has been leaked by Sonny Dixon, a very reliable source. And if he's right, it's going to be released next Tuesday with a new feature called Theater Mode. Now, when you go to the movie theater, there's a few things you do with your device, right? You put it in silent mode so you don't disturb the person next to you. You also dim the screen, make it darker. So this could be a dark mode coming next week with iOS 10.3. Now, if you follow me here on the betas with covering the betas for iOS 10, the first thing I always do is go into my settings and hope for a dark mode to be added to the display options, but it isn't. Now, hopefully, with this new release of iOS 10.3, if it is released on January 10th, we could be seeing real dark mode feature for iOS. Now, currently, I'm jailbroken on this iPhone 7 running iOS 10.1.1, and I'm rocking the Eclipse beta, and this is what you're seeing here. It isn't a real dark mode. I don't have iOS 10.3 installed as of yet, of course, but it is a cool feature to have on your device, and hopefully, Apple adds on top of that things like moving toggles around, adding additional toggles to your control center, and things like that. I don't see why. Apple wouldn't do this. If you take a look here at the right side of my screen, I have a low power mode. That's just something that's common sense to me, having a low power mode toggle on your control center. But we'll have to wait and see uh, what Apple does with 10.3. As I mentioned on my beta coverages, I was hoping for dark mode to be coming on the end cycle of iOS 10, and that's looking to be true, uh, just like you know the initial night shift uh, feature that came to iOS when it was released on the latter version of iOS 9, uh, the night shift option. You may remember that last year, but it's, it's it's something that I'm really hoping for. And by the way, if you're wondering about the wallpaper, it's going to be in the links down below and uh, the theme as well. And last but not least, I want to focus on jailbreaking. Now, a lot of you guys are waiting for a stable jailbreak that isn't in beta. And the gamma release was set to be released on the 27th of December last year, but that can happen. Uh, Luca Tedesco is aiming for more device support, as you can see there, and a lot of fixes for the jailbreak as well. So when can we expect the gamma release with other devices support? I'm hoping that Luca can push through this week the next software update for the jailbreak and a lot of devices will be supported. Of course, I will be posting a video on that information the minute it gets released. Right now, if you're on a jailbreakable device, a jailbreakable firmware, I recommend using the third beta of the jailbreak from Luca Tedesco. Links are gonna be in the description down below. If you wanna go ahead and try, the beta is very stable. In my opinion, it looks to be running very, very smoothly. You can see here, everything is a butter on my device. But if you have any doubts, any questions, you can always watch my videos on troubleshooting and things like that if you're having any issues. Device support should be coming soon, according to Luca. Again, a quick recap of everything. iOS 10.2.1 should be released today or tomorrow. iOS 10.3 with the new theater mode or dark mode should be released next Tuesday on the 10th. And we are also expecting the jailbreak to be released this week with other devices being supported and a more stable jailbreak. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I just wanted to pack everything into one. Hopefully this brings you up to date. I hope you guys have a great day. Make sure to stay tuned, of course, for everything Apple and iOS jailbreaks and software updates. It's been I Device Help, and I will catch you guys on the next one. Peace.